Hi everyone, it's great to see you today, wherever you are. Thanks for just stopping for a moment and I hope and pray that these uh, few words I share today will be an encouragement to you. A number of years ago I visited the Holy Land and we stayed for the first few nights on the shores of the Sea of Galilee. I dipped my toes in that water and I found the whole thing a very moving experience. A few days later we went out onto the sea itself on a boat trip and it was really gorgeous and it was perfectly calm. There is a story though with a completely different uh, scenario found in all three of the Gospels, Matthew, Mark and Luke, and uh, it talks about a storm that raged in that area. The wind is known to sort of sweep down and, and storms uh, arise fairly quickly. That can be quite alarming. The disciples and Jesus were going from one side of the lake to the other and Jesus uh, was asleep while the storm was raging and the disciples sort of shake him and wake him up and say, don't you care that we're going to perish? I think if we put a modern twist on that, we might say uh, that they would have uh, uh, said to Jesus, don't you care about the impact of this storm for us? Don't you care about what this storm might do to us? And I think it's fair to say that internationally we're in a storm at the minute. We're in choppy waters, uncertain waters, and it can be a little bit frightening. Jesus either will still the storm or he will speak peace into our heart while the storm rages. Psalm 46 verse 10 says, be still and know that I am God. So either he calms the storm or he will calm us and bring us peace for us to go through the storm with his presence and with uh, an awareness of his love. There's a gorgeous song that I used to listen to a number of years ago. It's called Sometimes He Calms the Storm. This came back to my mind this morning. I'm going to read the lyrics to you, then I'll put the link up. All who sail the sea of faith find out before too long how quickly blue skies can grow dark and gentle winds grow strong. Suddenly fear is like white water pounding on our soul. Still we sail on knowing that our Lord is in control. Sometimes he calms the storm with a whispered, peace be still. He can settle any sea, but it doesn't mean that he will. Sometimes he holds us close and lets the wind and waves go wild. Sometimes he calms the storm, other times he calms his child. And so I pray today that you would know him saying to you in your heart, peace, be still. The storm might be raging and we don't know the impact of it on one another, but we do know that Jesus is in the boat. Take care. It's been lovely to spend a few moments with you today. Bye for now.